even more muscles than bones. Impressive. Keep going. Some of my muscles are solitary muscles. Big beads, they move without anything that we to move. For example, if a body wants to keep something, the brain has to tell those muscles to move. The esophagus goes to the stomach and 
the windpipe push the balloon like lungs okay continue was the food is in the stomach the muscles then help to churn and mix the food with something called the gastric juices ha have you ever pick up that burning feeling in your throat those are some of the gastric juices coming back up a little we try to control them but sometimes they slip out a little the stomach mixes and mixes until basically the food is like a soup then it is sent to the small intestine which is a really long tube that's like a coiled up snake if you unfold this small intestine you would get about 20 to feet of tube that's the length of two pickup trucks bumper to bumper wow and that's the small intestine yes you own up and that's the food is broken down even more into vitamins minerals or any other nutrients for the body to use what's left gets passed to the large intestine also called the colon water and anything else that can be used is absorbed here and everything else gets pushed out as poo okay you do lot of work why are you important to the body thank you your honor i do work hard i am important to the body because without me the body would not get any vitamins minerals or nutrients from the food i do work best with a lot of water and nutritious food but without me the body would not get any energy to live to breathe or to move thank you digestive system how about the circulatory system my heart is pounding my blood is pumping your honor i want to let my actions speak for themselves will you play along with me for a minute go ahead thank you please take your pointer and middle finger and place them on your neck like this do you feel that pulse please take your and squeeze the base of one of your fingers hold it until your fingers hurt a little and turns purplish and cold this is basically what happens when your arm or leg falls asleep you cut off the blood flow to that area it hurts to because blood is important to our body and you don't want to lose much of it your my sister is the heart the arteries the blood vessels and the capillaries the heart pumps blood throughout the body through a bunch of tunnels which are the arteries the blood vessels and the capillaries your body is basically a big round map of tunnels in which every tunnel takes blood to the organ so they can work and do the arms legs fingers toes so they can walk too if the heart stops beating the blood stops moving if the blood stops moving the body stops working thank you circulatory system last but not the least let's hear from the nervous system your honor i think you will soon see that i am the most important system i am made up of the brain the spinal cord and the nerve cells i am basically the command center for the entire body i am in control if i tell the muscles to move they move i even control those involuntary movements that the muscular system talked about i control the sweating the beating of heart the lungs breathing the digestion of food without me none of it would happen so you think you are more important than everyone else because of this yes your honor to be honest i do i also control the senses i see hear smell taste i do it all i tell the body when something hurts as my nerve cells feel the pain and send messages to the brain and the brain quickly sends a message back for example If a hand is sitting on the hot stove, the nerve cells feel the pain and send me- and send a signal to the brain, and the brain makes the decision to pull the hand off the hot stove. All these messages get sent back through my nerves to the hand, and the person 
moves his hand before it is too badly burned. Important for sure. I don't mean to be rude, Your Honor, but without me, the body just cannot live. I am the main computer, the master of the body, the one in charge of everything. No one else can make a decision without me. I tell everyone else what to do, how to do it and when to do it. I never get a day off. I am even working while the body sleeps. In fact, I tell the body when to sleep. I tell it when to eat. I am the man in charge. Thank you, nervous system. Thank you all. The most important. Please be quiet for a few minutes and let me think. Without each other. Case settled, argument is 